Hello and welcome to the video everyone. In a recent video, some people rightly pointed out that I wasn't really multi-classing. I had just picked a warlock and then picked a bunch of different wizard stuff and then combined it, which isn't really that. So with that in mind, I've got a totally normal, you know, bog standard fighter build. I just wanted to play something like totally regular, really didn't want to, you know, buy into any of this multi-classing nonsense. So seeing as that's the case, I've just gone with Cutthroat, um, Backstep, Jolly Time, Brewmaster, Dagger Mastery, and then also, of course, Crossbow Mastery. Um, so just your standard fighter setup, really, um, with the Castellan Dagger and the Crossbow, and then I got an inventory full of Ale. And here's a bit of a quick look at what we're running presently. Yeah, honestly, I feel like as far as, you know, traditional fighter kits go, this is pretty much, you know, the one everyone first starts with, so... I imagine a lot of people are going to be saying to me in the comments below, like, man, I've already seen this. This is like, you know, overdone. But hey, you know, uh, it's a classic for a reason and you can't go past it. So that's why I picked this one. And that's why I want to showcase this one today. So I hope you guys enjoy. And don't forget to like the video. Thanks. So I went two games in a row without actually finding anyone. So at this point, I was thinking I might have been in another dead lobby. So I was kind of getting on here, ready to jump off but then lo and behold the door just opens so i'm like you know saints be praised thanks to the gods themselves because here we are and we're looking down what appears to be a warlock and i'm very primed to take this guy on with my standard fighter kit the uh the silence ability it's actually a very very strong uh, ability i think seeing as he's got spells as well i don't think he's gonna really anticipate it here because you know despite the fact that this has always been a standard fighter edition um no one who's a fighter really ever uses this one so yeah pretty nuts i i was so caught up in the first fight there that i actually forgot to even drink my ale and then lo and behold another goddamn player comes up right out of the woodworks we dodge him with a real quick back step there taking that arrow right away from us with a perfectly timed back step at this point i'm just wasting some time here i'm swigging i'm just wasting as much time as i can the cool thing about ale that i've realized is you can actually just swig 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 and it doesn't slow you down. So I'm just reloading my crossbow. Thankfully, I've got really, really quick crossbow reloads. He thinks he's actually got me here, which is kind of funny. I even, like, turn to take a shot. I'm walking backwards without a care in the world. And just backstep, just because, you know, I really wanted to rub it in there. He didn't really have a chance of hitting me here. I felt like I was a uh, much, much, much faster build than he was. So as long as I played smart, uh, he was never really going to get up on me, unless I wanted him to. So ready to play the crossbow game again. I fell back only to realize the damn cheeky bugger thought that he could start looting. That's my corpse. The hell do you think you're doing? Jumping on my corpse, taking my loot. All right, I wouldn't have a bar of that. So you know what, I just ran up on him. I was not waiting a moment at longer. Oh, <laughs> and he thought he'd turn into something and I ruined his damn day. The power of the fighter there really. Man, that silence really gets the job done. Now, I actually found the trail of someone in this one. So I was hot on it thinking, yep, this is definitely the way they've gone. Couldn't see any other way. And then I heard some warlock spells. So I quickly swigged one of these bad boys and saw my target. I took quick advantage of the fact that I had them on the run here. They were trying their best to stall, but I wasn't going to give them a moment to stall with. Unfortunately, I actually do end up missing my first three attacks here. I thought he'd be slower for some reason. It was a bit misleading. I end up making some space here, just barely dodging. And end up getting in with him with uh, three quick swipes. He seemed to miss all his dagger shit hits, so... Put me in a fortunate situation, I'll say. And I realized it was actually the same player that we went against in the previous game. Dodgy Dens. If only he had dodged those dagger blows, Den. Might have done him some good. Still... Look, honestly, what what can we do? Like, can we really blame this guy? He was up against the backstep. And again, the backstep massively underused. A fighter staple in my mind. But a lot of people don't run it on their fighters. Not sure why. It's been there the whole time. It's a really good one. They probably should be using it. But, you know, people are entitled to do what they want to do. So the moment I hear a rat, I start panicking. So I get back. Uh, try and see if I can locate the creature and then make the assessment if I'm going to swig. I see them, so take the pot and then take an ale. 
and get ready to go in. Of course, by go in, I mean, let's go ahead and just rail them with shots and see how long we can stall for, which wasn't really that long with this guy. They came up on me so damn quick. Really did a good job doing some quick damage there on me too. Uh, the panther moves so damn fast. It's just insane, really. But fortunately, I am in fact an alcoholic and ale is not a difficult thing for me to put back here. For people who haven't seen ale before, you can actually see the difference right now between an ale and also a health potion. See how the ale doesn't actually slow me down at all? There is a pretty good edge to the ale in that sense. You can just keep on swigging, they go down so quick. And you can also see this guy here, he didn't even have anything too crazy. Just shows you how powerful a panther is if you want to go on like a budget kit. Now, I took a luck potion on this one because I knew I was going to need it. Um, so, you know, I'm not really the luckiest guy, but fortunately, I did actually hear this guy just around the corner getting ready to come in on me. So, I set myself up for the fight pretty well. He thought he could get in close and close the distance, but once again, the back step just does so much work. And I was able to even get a cheeky headshot there. I think he uh, ends up wanting to back off hard here. And I even hear him hit his second win, so... That's what really made me think I hit the headshot there more than anything, because I wasn't even totally certain the way he had ducked there. But nonetheless, he was well and truly out of the room, fearful. Maybe it was an accidental second wind. Um, it's kind of hard to say, because I don't think my crossbow really would have done 40% of his health, realistically. But maybe he was already missing some health. Maybe there was some uh, miscalculations on their part, potentially. Either way, I keep hunting him down. I realize that they've gone down here and they really don't want to fight they just want to take me on a wild goose chase and i have no idea why that is um so i keep you know following following on i've realized they must have gone straight through here so i head right on up and get ready to engage with them one more time seeing as they're right there stall just a little bit longer get ready and then we're gonna go in for the kill and then what do i notice i realize the whole reason this guy was leading me on a wild goose chase oh no 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 what 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 no 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 no, 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 no. He was just waiting for my internet to crash. Hey, if you got this far, uh, most of my viewers that come back and watch these videos aren't actually subscribed, so make sure you hit that big red button and ring the bell so you get notified about the next uploads. And I will see you in the next one.